Hello guys, welcome back to Ticket Master and this is another ticket tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make an EMC darkroom. Okay, so basically how this works is bone meal gets fed through into a deployer. The deployer gets sent up into this uh, five by five uh, grass square, which then, because it's dark, the plants automatically break. So then the plants go into here and make more bone meal so that the process can continuously work. But then I've filled it up with these cobblestone corner covers so that all the debris of that that can't fit into the condenser goes into the other condenser which have just been left running for about 10 minutes now and the, and you can see all the debris going into here so yeah it's a uh, you know you can survive off if you just put one bone meal in here it will make a load more just instantly but at first it will be a bit clunky but then it will get much faster okay so I'll just show you how to do this so what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a trans you're gonna need transposers and you're gonna need filters, deployers, one deployer, and then you're gonna need redstone tubes. Now the redstone tube is the important bit, not pneumatic tubes, redstone tubes. And you're gonna need jacketed wire. You don't have to have jacketed wire, but I just like using it. So let's choose something fancy. Right. Uh, iron, stone, is there that emerald? Yeah, ruby block. I'll just take some of that. And then you need timer. Then red alloy wire. And condensers, yeah. Two condensers. Okay, so oh wait, you're gonna need dirt as well, so let's just put all these these up here. Get some grass and some dirt. I would recommend building this up in the sky like I did over here because it's just much easier. Right, so you go one, two, three, and you put the grass block down. What or, or grass because you can you can use a philosopher's stone for this to make it into cobblestone and into grass, but because I'm in a desert biome, it makes it into sand. So, so I'm just making it. So one, two, three, four, five, three, four, five, three, five. Now, for the, this next bit that I'm going to show you, you can use any material that you want. But just for the sake of this, I'm just going to use dirt. Alright, so then what you want to do is you want to make a... Like a barrier. Around here. Around the whole of this thing. And what, you're going, what you want to do is you want to put your transposer bang in the the put it underneath the block bang in the middle so where is that so you got one two, it should be like right here okay so then what you want to do is get a screwdriver and make it so that that flat bottom is that yeah like that okay i'm just going to get a shovel real quick Okay, so then, now that bit's done under there, you can go back to getting your dirt, and you're going to want to put one dirt here, 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 and here, so in the centre of those, then build across like a, like a little row thing, and cover up the corners into like a three, so that you've got that one block gap. So that it kind of looks like a dirt pie, if you know what I'm saying. Like, imagine if you have the apples inside and stuff. So, anyway, that's just random. You have the transposers here. And now you want to have the small, that side, the one with the small circle, which is the output, like that. And you want to connect these up 
with redstone tubes. Now right, what you want to do is you want to go down here. Like this and you want to get one condenser and you want to put it here. Now I'm going to get get some bone meal. Right, so first of all in the transposer we're going to need uh, um, no, in the deployer, sorry, we're going to need all of them. And then in here, this has got to be creating bones. So, once we've done this, we're going to need our filter. There you go, the filter. Now, the filter is going to carry around all of these. Wait, I'm going to just do it on the other side. Get a pickaxe. I'm going to do this on the other side so that it's quicker. Like that. And then in the filter you want to put one bone meal in there. So you've got one bone meal in here, one bone meal in here. And about a stack so that it gets started. So then what you want to do is, because these are redstone tubes of red power, they're clever tubes. So if there's no space in here, like over here, where is it? Right, over here because you see there's no space it's sending all the debris over to the other condenser so the condenser is making a lot of diamonds Oops, I just passed it. so then what you want to do is you put another one down and in this one you want to put some diamonds just want to put at least just one in there and then I'm gonna oops I'm going to take that just for speeding up the process of the other one. So now you've got this, you're going to need, this is like the main bit now, which is the powering. So I've used these jacketed wires because they're really useful. So, oh, turn, oh god, I got, let me just get one of these, turn you off. So what, what I like to do is I like to do it like this. Not like that. Whoops. And then, because that's now powering all of those, then I put one there. Yep, so then... Everything's powered now. And now do you see? Because the timer is ticking constantly, the, tra the deploy is deploying all of that, and the Transposers are picking them up very quickly. So just to speed this thing this thing up. There you go. Now we should just wait. There you go. Now all of that should going in, be going into here. I'll just put all of this stuff in there. And you see wait if I take out like this see how quickly it's going now? You don't have to put a stack of diamonds in, but if you just wait out here for about 10-15 minutes, uh, or may like, depends though, because, like, well, it's a bit confusing, but, anyway, if you just wait here for this whole chest to be full, or you could do what I did, and fill it up with something that can't be condensed, i.e. these cobblestone corner covers, and then the debris will automatically go in there, because now all of this is full, that it's all just going to go in there. And as you can see, the bone meal is getting pumped out from here and into the deployer. So at first, the deployer is going to lose about 30 bone meal, I would say, because it's pumping it out and the condenser hasn't had a chance to make any of the bone meal. But otherwise, um, yeah, that's, that's about it. And you can also extend this by going out this way. So if you go out that way, and like you carry on these what I've done here and you just carry it on with another deployer under there and stuff you can make it very big okay so thanks for watching stay tuned for another take it tutorial